Welcome back! We're looking around the exhibits of the museum at Herrn Kimsee. Let's see. I have no idea what that says. Looks old, though. I think that's actually the same newspaper clipping that's also in the... ...on display in the Gasthof in Rittersburg. You can see it a bit clearer here, though. Apparently, um, according to Huber, it tells the truth about uh, Ludwig's supposed suicide. Which he believed was murder. Oh my god. That's the sleigh for my dream. Right, the dream. I almost forgotten about that. Maybe Mrs. Smith will know what my dream meant. I have to ask someone. This thing is getting too weird. Do we have to ask her? <laughs> Can't we, I don't know, find someone else? No, unfortunately, she is our only hope. Um, let's see. Ludwig embarking on his sleigh. It's not a one-horse open sleigh, it's a four-horse open sleigh, by the look of it. The Midnight Sleigh Rides. Ludwig went on long sleigh rides in the middle of the night, particularly in his later years. It is said that he suffered from insomnia, headaches, and toothaches, and the rides soothed his restlessness. The sight of the king's grand sleigh speeding through the countryside of the Alps often startled the peasants and became a superstitious omen of ill fortune. I can see why, but what was he doing out there at night? Maybe he just wanted some fresh air. Or maybe not. What's this? Ludwig's death mask. Wow. It's apparently, again, something they did. Making wax masks of uh, people who died. Important people, anyway. But also a display below the picture. Two letters, apparently. December 14th, 1881, Linderhof. Order another work by Jennings on the occult. Write urgently to Klug, saying that I insist that the stoppages by the bank cease. I want it, and therefore it must be done. Write very urgently. He must succeed at once, and then must report to me urgently. If I give orders to clear my room, doing so must not be postponed as it happened. Pencils must be pointed without special orders. The day after tomorrow, a thousand marks. How is Louis now? I want to know whether he looks unhappy. How often have I said that the coffee must not come up boiling hot, so that it can only be drunk after standing an hour? If any more correspondence come from Louis, they are to be burnt immediately. But I am to be informed of their arrival. Sounds like Louis had fallen out of favor, for whatever reason. Also, it sounds like uh, Ludwig was beginning to lose his mind. These are actual notes from Ludwig to his servants. They go far in showing the king's state of mind. They were smuggled out and used as evidence in compiling the order for Ludwig's arrest. Ah, oh, so that's what that was. Let's see what the other one says. December 18th, 1881, Linderhof. Every day get up earlier, for certain. See to that very particularly. Write it down. Remember that when the great friend arrives at Neuschwanstein, we retire to the hall. We are not to be disturbed. I will not tolerate interference or insubordination. The great friend is a reference to Wagner again. wonder what they were up to. Writing a secret wolf opera, perhaps. I think that's it for the exhibits. But we kind of want to... Um, find out more about both Wagner's connection and um, the diary. And that means we have to talk to this weird woman again. As much as I am loath to. Guten Tag. Guten Tag. Of all the people in this game, she really sounds the most like she has never ever spoken a word of German before in her entire life. Anyway. Ludwig's Tagebuch in Museum? 
Ja. Wo kann ich Ludwigs Tagebuch hier anschauen? Die Tagebücher sind ganz persönlich. Die sind in den königlichen Archiven. Niemand darf die lesen. Aber nein, niemand darf die lesen. Danke. Okay, that was unhelpful. We have another question to ask, though. Guten Tag. Guten Tag. And by the way, she said no one read the diary, but didn't the author of that autobiography said that he had access to the diary? I think he did. Let's ask about this new Wagner opera. Though I'll, I doubt she knows anything about that. Im Museum es einen Brief von Ludwig über eine neue Wagner Oper. Ja, ja, ich kenne diesen Brief. Wo kann ich äh, mehr von dieser Wagner Oper sehen? Ja, ich weiß nichts über Wagner. Das hier ist kein Wagner Museum. Ja, ich weiß. In Bayreuth befindet sich ein Wagner Museum. Versuchen Sie es halt doch, ne? Bayreuth. Danke. Okay, well, at least uh, we found out what we wanted to know. And now we have a new location on the map, which uh, is the Wagner Museum in Bayreuth. So let's go there next. Grüß Gott. Guten Tag. Is das the Wagner Museum? Yeah, ja. you're an American, aren't you? I'm afraid the house is closed this time of year. It will be open next month. Crap. <laughs> you are interested in Wagner? Very interested. Very recently very interested. Yeah. Most of the house is closed for cleaning, but uh, a few rooms are open. I shouldn't let you, probably, but uh, if it is only you, you are alone, aren't you? Endlessly. <laughs> Come in and look over. That's very generous. Um, what do I owe you? Georg. Georg Immerding. It's only a few displays. Besides, I wouldn't be much of a um, shining knight if I charge you. Thanks, Georg. My name is Grace. Hello. Have a good time. Was he hitting on her? I'm fairly sure he was. Oh well. I think it's good that uh, Gabriel is not the only one getting attention from the opposite sex in this game. And from the same sex, for that matter. But anyway, let's look around the uh, Wagner Museum. A piano. Concert Flügel. It's a grand piano. Wagner's piano. On this piano, the maestro composed his later operas, including The Ring. If they say so. I guess this is also uh, taken from a real museum, so I suppose it must be true. Franz Liszt, composer and Cosima Wagner's father. And Richard Wagner Fogner. himself. Nice neck beard. This is actually a circle, so we just uh, follow the rooms until we get back where we started. It's not that much to see here. An old sofa. Must be important for some reason. Let's check the sign. The death of Wagner. On Ash Wednesday, 1883, Wagner suffered a heart attack in a Venetian gondola on the way to San Michel. His wife and the gondolier carried him into a church where he regained consciousness. Wagner died four days later on this sofa. Oh, not just an old sofa then? Wagner died on that sofa. That's kind of creepy. Kind of interesting that you, uh, that Grace will 
say something else after you read the sign. Doesn't happen very often in this game. Let's see. Oh, another death mask. Wagner's death mask. And his death hand? I have no idea. Can't look at it either. A disc. It looks rather simple considering the grandiose stuff Wagner composed here. What were you expecting? Wagner's desk. Exactly as it was on the day he died. Exactly? What's on it then? It's a letter from a Monsieur Beaujolais, dated September 1881. Looks like he's discussing acoustics and sound waves. And crystals. Wasn't Wagner's Bayreuth Theater already built? Why would Wagner be worrying about acoustics? It looks like an architectural drawing of a theater. The Wittelsbacher Theater, München. Every square inch is measured. Why am I reminded of Atris all of a sudden? It seems like the kind of thing he would do. Well, I'm sure it's not important. Hey, we know this guy. It's Ludwig. The great patron himself. Can we read this sign? No. Apparently not. Ludwig as the classical Greek hero. I guess the connection between Ludwig and Wagner is important enough to be um, acknowledged in a Wagner museum. Ludwig's death mask. We already saw that in the other museum. July 1882. Great and beloved king, Monsieur Beaujolais and I have finished the diagram. We checked the figures many times and Monsieur is confident that it will work. Eight identical fixtures are to be made from the diagram and placed in the theater exactly as specified. I'm sending the diagram with your courier. Be full of hope and have courage. All will be well. Your own, Wagner. But the diagram is still on his desk, so I don't think he ever sent it. June 10th, 1881, Munich residence. Great friend, I am writing to you in the middle of the night. My blood is pounding too wildly for sleep. Tonight's performance, how can I describe it? I am unsure whether to be terrified or thrilled. Perhaps I even feel hopeful? If it is hope, you have given it to me, my friend, for the first time in years. We must speak. Something happened during the music tonight, but I must have your absolute confidence. As you love me, come at once. Your devoted king, Ludwig. Hmm. What were these two conspiring about? A portrait given as a gift from Ludwig to Wagner. Portrait of Ludwig, by the looks of it. All right, next room. These look like production designs. I don't see anything that looks like those wolf paintings in Neuschwanstein, though. Nope. These look like production I don't see any- Oh, same, uh, message? Wait, is that all we can look at? Seems like it. Opera costumes. Elaborate. This must be a model of Wagner's own theater, here in Bayreuth. I guess so. This must be... And I think that is the last room. Now there's a couple of things that we want to talk about, since we didn't really um, find anything out about the new opera. Maybe Georg at the front desk can help us with that. But we'll have to do that in the next video.